Hey everyone, welcome back to another video by Psych2Go. First off, thank you to our amazing audience out there. You've now reached over 3 million. It's with your support that we're able to continually bring content that will surely add to your knowledge. Psych2Go's vision is to make psychology accessible for everyone, as well as occasionally covering topics around mental health. Our mission is to help everyone become more self-aware of the various psychological factors that affect one's life. Now, onto the video. For centuries, people have found love and companionship in animals. That bond has only grown stronger as time went on. Animals were domesticated or brought indoors and are now a part of millions of families worldwide. They take center stage in family photos and go everywhere their human goes. Some of them even have their own Instagram account. Pet owners give so much to their animals, but do they get anything in return? Research shows that pet owners tend to have lower blood pressure, reduced cholesterol, and fewer reports of depression and loneliness. But the benefits don't stop there. The changes that a pet brings to your everyday life can be a positive impact on your habits and emotions. Here are seven ways having a pet can benefit your mental health. One, they encourage you to be active. Having a pet is a lot of work, no matter what species you care for. And larger animals such as dogs and horses will keep you active in your day-to-day -day life. Exercise, or even just a little physical activity, releases chemicals called neurotransmitters in your brain. The receptors in your brain react to these chemicals and trigger certain reactions and perceptions, such as an elevated mood. Even a short walk around the block is beneficial for both you and your pet. Two, pets can sense when something isn't right. Animals are instinctual creatures who can often sense the emotional distress of others. They tend to be very observant of nonverbal communication. Dogs, for example, will learn your normal behaviors and habits, and they'll connect the dots and know when something isn't right if you start behaving differently. Some dogs might get more protective, while others will cuddle up. Some cats might bring you a surprise from outside, while others might sit next to you for a while. Each animal is unique and will react differently to the same situations. But odds are, they're just trying to figure out how to make everything better. Three, there are reason to get out of bed in the morning. Lack of motivation can feel like the end of the world, especially if you're battling depression. If you have a pet though, you have a reason to get out of bed every day and push yourself to get something done, even if it's just feeding the bird or walking the puppy. You may not always feel like you've been the most productive, but you make a huge impact on your pet's life by caring for them and spending some time together. Four, you'll never be lonely. Having a pet means having a companion. Some animals may interact more than others, but you can always spend some time near your pet if they're not the type to cuddle or be touched. It helps to know that you're not alone. Animals are great listeners too. They'll keep all your secrets safe and they won't judge you for anything you say or feel. So when you have a pet, don't forget that you always have someone to talk to. Five, pet care can add structure and routine to your schedule. Most pet families fall into a kind of routine, either for feeding, grooming, or even vet appointments. Having set routines ensures that important tasks get done and no one ever has to wonder or worry about when to do them. Developing the habit of following routines is good for stress management too. Dr. Steve Orma, a clinical psychologist specializing in sleep, anxiety, and stress, believes routine is beneficial in maintaining low stress levels in people as well. In his words, routine also helps with stress. Create a set schedule for doing chores, work tasks, meetings, exercise, paying bills, and all the usual things you need to do. Put these into your schedule. Once this becomes your normal routine, it's easier to accomplish everything because it becomes a habit. Six, you'll meet other pet owners and animal lovers. Pets make for great conversation starters and attention grabbers, so don't feel surprised if you make a few new friends while showing off your own four-legged friend. They can help ease you into conversation if socializing isn't your forte, and you'll never be off topic by bringing the conversation back to your pet. Having your buddy with you will give you that extra assurance that it'll all be okay. Even if the conversation gets a little awkward, before you know it, you'll have friends of all species. And seven, they'll help you live in the moment. It's difficult to remain lost in your own thoughts when your pet is in your lap begging for attention. Distractions like these help bring your mind back into focus on the present moment and what's right in front of you, rather than fixating on worries and negativity. Harvard researchers have been studying the ways pets can encourage mindfulness in their owners. They encourage you to observe your pet while out in the world. A dog on a walk is alert and curious, taking it all in. But how do we become the same? 
Harvard Health Publishing offers this simple mindfulness exercise any dog owner can try next time they're out for a walk. So try this. As you start your walk, take a moment to bring your attention to the sensations in your body. Breathe in through your nose, let your abdomen expand fully, then breathe out through your mouth. Notice the sensations of each inhalation and exhalation. As you continue to walk, engage your senses fully. Notice each sight, touch, and sound. Savor every sensation. When your mind wanders, and it undoubtedly will, gently bring your attention back to the moment, including your dog's delight at being with you and outdoors. Does this video make you long for a furry little companion of your own? If you already have a pet, did it make you want to go cuddle them even closer? Let us know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, be sure to share it with someone who would benefit from it too. Don't forget to subscribe for more content and check out the sources in our video description. Thanks for watching. See you next time.